Well, it's been a historic week for the U.S. bobsled team in Sochi, snapping a 62-year drought in the two-man bobsled. Yeah, Steve Holcomb piloted the bobsled, but just a few years ago, Steve thought he might never see again. Jerry's got his amazing story. Barreling toward his lifelong quest for a gold medal, bobsled champ Steve Holcomb's Olympic dreams came to a crashing halt. I kind of had to retire because I could no longer see. Stricken nearly blind, diagnosed with carotid Keratoconus, a degenerative weakening of the cornea. Keratoconus affects millions of people worldwide. Steve's eye specialist, Dr. Brian Boxer Walkler, simply stunned that Steve even tried to drive a bobsled upwards of 90 miles an hour without being able to see. But blindness, shattered Olympic hopes, and a deep depression sent Steve over the edge. I did try to take my own life. It was at that dark moment when Steve found Dr. Brian who performed his pioneering procedure. Completely non-invasive and it's only 30 minutes. This before and after video showing the dramatic results. And after Steve's vision saving procedure, his Olympic dream came true at the 2010 games in Vancouver. Over. Dr. Brian there as the U.S. bobsled team won their first gold medal in 62 years. It's been a bumpy ride, but something that, uh, you know, I'm proud of. Steve, going for a computer science degree at DeVry University, already with a bronze for the two-man at Sochi, going for a gold in the four-man this weekend. Dr. Brian there cheering him on once again.